Tracy, Steve, I talked with a few of Adam Camarado's relatives as they walked the edge of the water here. They say that he actually works just up the road from here and had finished up at a bar when he went missing. It's now been five days since anyone has heard from him. We search all like along the waters, under the docks, anywhere like possibly like in this area. Police and family members have turned their attention to the water as they look for any sign of Adam Camarado. Posters with his face are hanging up throughout the park near where his phone last sent out a signal. You would say this is definitely out of character for way him. Way out of character. Way out of character for Adam. He's... We don't know what's going on. He was last seen closing out his tab a little before one Saturday morning. Police then tracked his phone for about 10 minutes to the edge of the water. It was raining that night too, so it, and it was pouring. Like the, the current here is insane, so could have been just very slippery rocks. He could have fell. Like who knows? Any anything could happen. Police are calling it an active search at this point. People have spotted boats and divers checking the water. Family and friends spent Tuesday looking all around the banks of the river. Several returned today, including Camarado's younger sister. Hard saying, we're just hoping and praying for the best. Like, oh, I'm just like so numb at this point. Like, we just want him back so bad. And the family plans to be back out here tomorrow to continue that search. Steve. And obviously, Tyler, investigators are trying to piece together the final steps, the last moments that they know of before he went missing. And Tyler, I understand you know who was the last person apparently to talk to him before he went missing? Steve, we talked with his sister who said that he had talked with his ex-wife a few hours before he went missing. He had made plans to pick up his kids for baseball practice the following morning. Live in Portsmouth, Tyler Catterett, WMTW News 8. We'll send it back to you, Steve. All right, Tyler, thank you. We're going to turn